Alright guys, on the lot here and I am playing wait for it. Thank you, Alasad. Okay, I'm gonna start doing more commentary since apparently I've been getting requests for that, believe it or not. So I'm gonna just try to make the best out of this. I basically joined this game because I wanted to test out some turtle beaches Tyler and I made. Yes, we actually made these with $28 mics. And it actually works better than we thought, as I proved right there. I figured right about now, I'd throw me a little nade toward a random area. And lucky me, I get a kill. And I guess also Treyarch doesn't know that the weekend is Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Not Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and so on and so forth. Get lucky, kid. Get lucky. Okay, well, I just got killed by a lucky ass shotgun person. But I recover from that. But on a serious note, this game has some of the worst spawn systems I've seen since Soulcom. Okay, for those who haven't played SOCOM, let me just play you. The past four SOCOMs had like a spawn, an A spawn and a B spawn. If the other team had like three people in your spawn, you were not going to have fun for the rest of that game. They would literally sit in your spawn with the AK-47, M4, M16, whatever the hell they had, and just rape you. There was nothing you could do about it. On the 360 version of COD 4, if I remember correctly, you did spawn your team. You spawned your teammates nearby, just like World at War Week. However now, for some reason Treyarch chose to nerf with it, and now you spawn in a box for two minutes straight. I mean, really, if the other team finds out where you are, it's over. You become their bitch for two minutes. And two minutes is all it takes to lose a match on COD. Due to that one fact in the Wii version of the game, I decided to rename Team Deathmatch to several things. The two names I came up with were Call of Duty Spawn Warfare and Let's Chase the Losing Team Around the Map. For spawn system like that, I'm starting to think that maybe Treyarch asked four year olds what they wanted on the Wii version. Because really, only a four year old would think of something like that. To spawn in one spot. Zipper! <coughs> do you agree with me or do you disagree with me? Either way, write your opinion in the comments and I gladly find out. Alright, so that's it for my rant. As I said, disagree or disagree if you want. Time to talk about the game again. I get this guy. And I'm now just gonna run around. Run, run, run. Heard him coming, so I just took advantage of that. Oh, this is what I'm hearing through my headphones right now.
imagine hearing that for about 10 to 20 minutes and even longer if I even keep playing the game. It's not as fun as one would hope. And yeah, those guys are actually spawning behind me and I did not realize it. But whatever, me and my teammate, we're putting in work, I mean my clanmate, we're putting in work, we're carrying these guys. And I only got one more death before I never die again. Knowing how this game usually goes, and in the pace this game definitely been going, it's gonna be both. My clanmate and I were basically taking out these guys, and I guess the rest of my team caught on at where the party's at, because they all came over here. Me, here I got really greedy, and just told to hop over, and I get blown up by a lucky ass maid. Get lucky. Since they not gonna leave this for me anytime soon, I just guess I bring the party over to them. Get my first lucky spray. And this guy gets lucky. Lucky one shot almost killed me. But I take over and saw him who's boss. Go down this tunnel. And guess this sucker. This game is already over as you can tell. This team really had no chance facing two clan members. This guy doesn't turn the corner, he has something in his hand, but he doesn't throw it at me. He could have really killed me right there, but he didn't take advantage. So I do it right about now. Nice timing. 21, 2, 7, 3 to 1 KDR. Comment, rate, subscribe.